Hello, viewers and listeners of Checkpoint Zone. Today's video is about how you can verify your vehicle papers. Now, the reason I'm making this video is because uh, when I went to renew my roadworthiness um, around uh, Bagada, there was a guy that I met there whose um, certificate was not issued after his test was done because uh, they found out that he had some uh, document infractions which attracted him uh, some fine which he hadn't paid and according to the guy he said he didn't even know when it happened except that uh, he got a message someday and when he saw the message he just uh, deleted it thinking maybe it was one of all these uh, funny uh, cyber uh, criminals trying to make him to send money to some account so um i had to explain to him but while trying to you know even get him to understand the guy was so you know angry and in shock that he wasn't even giving me audience so that led me to uh coming on to making this video so that uh if you are the type that normally gives money to maybe your driver or someone else to help you um renew your papers you might have to be doing this after you know they give you your papers the simple reason is um the vio guys now uh they are adopting this technology known as uh, ampr which is automatic number plate recognition so what this does is um it uses optical character recognition on images to read vehicle registration plate number so once it captures your vehicle plate number the next thing it's going to do is to go into the database of vehicle license the database of roadworthiness and the database of insurance so it's going to run your number your vehicle uh, uh, registration number through all of these databases so if you are the type maybe going around with um, fake or ingenuine papers it's going to spot it and it will send you the system will send you a notification message that you've been found wanting in these areas and it will also let you know the fine that is that each one of uh, these infractions are attracts so in order not to run into this every time you do your papers or you renew your papers always check in my own case i do comprehensive insurance all the time and I found out uh, uh, there was a time I did my I, I renewed my insurance and out of curiosity I just came to NID which is the portal from which you can verify the uh, um, to verify your document so out of curiosity I came to uh, ask NID and I checked I realized that my policy wasn't active so what would have happened to me was that if I, if I was driving and uh, um, the camera captured my number, they would have sent that notification to me. And I called my insurance uh, uh, marketer. I told him and he said he was so sorry that I must have been the lady that did the renewal that probably forgot to quickly upload it because I checked this thing like five minutes after uh, they gave me the renewal documents. So he told me that he was going to look into it and like uh, 5, 10, 15 minutes later, he called me, I checked it and it was okay. So this is what you have to do. Now for vehicle roadworthiness, this is a direct link. For uh, vehicle license verification, this is a direct link. And for vehicle insurance verification, this is a direct link. So let's quickly go and check all of these links. So the first one we are going to be checking is that of uh, vehicle uh, VIO. So this is the home page of uh, the Lagos State Vehicle uh, Inspection uh, Office. And right on top here, they have check road worthiness certificate validity. So here, clicking on this, it will give you this search bar where, as you can see, it says vehicle registration number. So I'm going to register. Sorry, I'm going to enter mine. So, 
one thing i've realized here on this particular page is that i've tried many times to come here and verify even though i was the one that took my card there by myself i just wanted to see you know you know just that uh habit of be always verifying so that uh, you don't end up running into infractions before you start uh uh trying to verify so i realized that this page forever keeps loading so if any one of the vio uh, uh staffs are watching this video i think you guys have to get in touch with your it department or the vendor in charge to look into this i have tried this i tried it yesterday like four times today i'm trying it again you can see it just keeps rolling endlessly so now not to waste much of our time let's go on to the next one so this is where you try to verify your auto rent which is your vehicle license so now one other thing i found out on this portal is that okay this was the search i did yesterday so i'm going to go over it again so one other thing i found out on this portal is uh uh is that so if you are watching this video and you work with auto red or you know anybody that works in auto red please tell them that they need to go and get their website certificate i mean it's not fine for people to come here and be seeing this not secured icon if you check that on the vi you can see this padlock this means it is secured meaning there is a certificate authority that knows about this website so you cannot uh, you don't have anything to worry about once you see this but if you come to any website and you see this it raises the red flag so guys in the auto rage uh, department please look into this you can get your IT staff or your vendor to help you uh, renew this certificate so coming down to the verification I've entered my vehicle registration this um, cap charges show that I am not a robot then searching now the good thing about this website is it is very responsive you can see in less than 30 seconds you already returned my search so you can see the amount paid validity and expiry vehicle license expiry date is 12th June 2024 and right now it's still valid so we we'll move on to the next one which is that of insurance so if you have just renewed your insurance right regardless of the fact that it could be maybe um uh, third party or comprehensive all you need to do is to come to this place right so you can either do for a single set or a fleet and do for a single set now you can set with either policy number or registration number so i've entered my registration number here and i'm searching so let's see what it takes on Okay, this one is taking a little time. All right. So now, this is what we have here. It shows my policy number, every other information. But the part I really want you to pay attention to is this, where it says license status. Policy is active. So these are just simple checks that you, will, you, you 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 might want to do if you are not the type that goes around to renew your document by yourself and uh you know how to verify that what has been given to you is authentic so i hope this video helps if it does please subscribe to this channel like share and also don't forget to hit the bell icon so that I can be one of the first to know when we release other videos in future. So, see you in the next video by God's grace. Bye.